my fabulous readers today we are going to read the star of the zoo by virgin sucher daniel hall little star twinkle like a diamond in the clear night sky far below her the zoo was still and quiet The animals were getting ready for bed. Then suddenly Little Star lost her balance and tumbled out of the sky. Down, down, down. She fell like a shooting star. She left a sparkling trail all the way to the ground. Ouch, she cried as she landed with a bump. All the animals ran to see what had happened. "Who oh, no, are you all right, little star?" asked Zebra. "Can we help you? I need to get back into the sky so I can twinkle like a diamond," little star said sadly. "I'll help you," said the lion. "I am the strongest animal in the zoo." Lion pickled up little star, climbed into climbed onto a rock and lifted her high into the air. Lion could lift little star easily, but he couldn't reach the sky. I can help, Colant. Ha 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 ha, laughed the lion. You are too small. You can't help. I'll help you, said the monkey. I am the best climber in the zoo. Monkey pickled up the little star and jumped into a tree he swung through the branches to the very top monkey climbed as high as he could but he couldn't reach the sky i have a plan called ant ha 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 laughed monkey you are too small you can't help i'll help you said giraffe i am the tallest animal in the zoo Giraffe picked up the little star, stood up straight, and stretched her neck as far as she could. Giraffe was very tall, but she couldn't reach the sky. I know what to do, called Ant. Hey, 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 hey! Laughed Giraffe. You are too small. You can't help. Little star's brightness was fading. I have to be. Back in the sky before sunrise, she cries. Give me a chance. I can help, called Ant. The animals all just stared at Ant. What could she do? Well, if you think you can do it, you might as well try, said the lion, rolling his eyes. Ant scuttled off. She came back not with ten. Not with a hundred, but with thousands of friends to help. And picked up the little star and climbed into another's ant back. And that ant climbed onto another ant. And that ant climbed onto another. The tower of ants grew higher and higher until they reached the sky. You did it! You did it! Shouted the little star. All the animals cheered. Anything's possible if you work together, and said proudly. Little star smiled, happy to be home. She twinkled like a diamond all night long. Far below, the animals finally snuggled down and went to sleep. The end. I hope you love the story. We will see you again with another beautiful story. Till then, bye bye. Love you all.